Hi friends, welcome to the lesson. In this lesson, we are going to know about Lewis dot diagrams. What is a Lewis dot diagram? A Lewis structure is a diagram that shows the covalent bonds and lone electron pairs in a molecule. What does this mean? It is a picture that shows the symbol of the element in the middle and the number of covalent electrons that it contains using the 288 rule that are symbolized by dots. How do you figure out the number of dots? Let us start with the element lithium. We can see that it has three protons that is atomic number. So we can assume that it has three electrons. If you if we drew it out using the 288 rule, it would look like this. We can see that lithium has one electron in the outermost shell. So, we know it has one covalent electron that is valence electron. As per Lewis, the number of dots on a Lewis dot diagram is simply the number of covalent electrons that is valence electrons that an element has. The Lewis dot diagram for lithium would look like this because it has one covalent electron or valence electron. Let us try another example oxygen. This is the element oxygen on the periodic table. First, uh, draw it out using the 288 rule. It should look like this. How many valence electrons are there? Look at the picture. There are 6 valence electrons. Now, let us try to draw the Lewis dot diagram for oxygen. It should look like this. Look here, two ordered pairs, two single electrons or unpaired electrons. We have to show like this. Now, let us draw the Lewis dot diagram for boron. Boron number is 5. That means it has 3 electrons in the outermost shell. So, the Lewis diagram for boron should look like this. Now, let us draw the Lewis dot diagrams for molecules. Look here, first example that is carbon tetrachloride. First of all, we have to write sum of valence electrons. C is having 4 electrons and uh, chlorine is having 7 valence electrons. There are 4 atoms, so 28 electrons. Total 32 electrons. Now, skeletal structure. First of all, we have to write center atom will be the first atom of the formula. That is C. Place the other atoms around the center atom. That is chlorine. We have to place four chlorines. Connect each atom to the center with a covalent bond. Each bond accounts for two electrons. So, eight electrons. The remaining are 24. Now, distribute the remaining electrons. Look here. In this way, we have to distribute. Total 24 over. Now, what we have to check? Check to make sure octet rule is satisfied. Look here. All the chlorines are satisfied octet rule. What about carbon? It also satisfied octet rule. So, the Lewis structure of 
carbon tetrachloride is like this now another example ammonia nh3 sum of valence electrons ammonia has five electrons hydrogen is having one valence electron so there are three hydrogens total eight valence electrons are there now what we have to write skeletal structure first you have to write center atom that is n next place the other atoms around the center atom that is h look here in this way we have to place now connect each atom to the center atom with a covalent bond each bond accounts for two electrons total electrons six the remaining are two electrons distribute the remaining electrons hydrogen do not need any more electrons they only need two so we have to write two electrons on nitrogen so check to make sure octet rule is satisfied look here here hydrogen is an exemption it only needs two electrons so this is the lewis dot structure next example 3 co2 sum of valence electrons carbon has four valence electrons oxygen has six electrons so two oxygen means 12 electrons total 16 electrons first of all we have to write the center atom that is carbon and place the other atoms around the center atom that is oxygen after writing this we have to connect each atom to the center with a covalent bond each bond accounts for two electrons total four the remaining electrons are 12 so distribute the remaining electrons to outer atoms look here we have to distribute the electrons like this now what we have to check check to make sure octet rule is satisfied look here oxygen satisfied this oxygen also satisfied now we have to count carbon only four are there it is not satisfied what we have to do create multiple bonds shift the electrons now we have to check oxygen satisfied the octet rule and carbon also satisfied the octet rule so this is the lewis structure for co2 thank you